that. BLM. So the BLM is purchasing hay yeah. to slaughter this man's cows. Yeah. Well, that was just part of the, the you know, look good. You know what I mean? Because obviously, where is it now? Did they go and drop it off at some farm somewhere where it could be used? No. There it is sitting right there. This is Corey who's Houston? Houston. Houston. Houston, like Texas. And uh, uh, and Corey and I went around, uh, Corey and I went around, uh, he took us around all around this property. Well, not all around it because 600,000 is too much, but uh, showed us where those uh, bulls were that uh, BLM's uh, were responsible for their execution. And then there, this site, which we didn't get to get into until BLM left. And uh, that's what we're doing is this is the mass grave where the genocide of, uh, of, this, of the uh, Bundy's herd uh, took place. Now there's the backbone of a, of a, of a cow in there that uh, he's probably filming down there now, but the expectation is that there's gonna be 30 or so, maybe uh, a head of uh, cattle in here. But uh, we'll see, because they might have left a bunch of them, shot them out in, the, out in that 600,000 acres. There might be just one. There might be just one, but uh, but, but it's sure a pretty did, big hole. They sure did big a pretty big hole, so they were anticipating more. You can see that that soil in this hole, where on all around it, where it, it's had it's, it's settled and, it, and it's firmed up, and you can see where Corey's digging. So this wasn't dug by him today. Just the section off the top here, he scratched off. You can see the different colors of soil. So this is a an old hole that was dug by BLM and the rest of their murderous friends, and uh, to put those the cattle in. So it'll probably be quite disgusting in it anyway uh, to see this, but uh, uh, it'll be necessary so we can determine who the domestic terrorists really are. How many you're going to keep digging? Yeah. Hey, Trace, yeah. come over here on your camera and take a picture of that and Facebook it right now. We need to take the Wi-Fi and turn it on in the truck because if somebody shows up at her and tries to confiscate our camera, it's already out. guys on camera can't s smell this but the smell is just unbelievable You're telling me this is what my brother died for and my father fought for I don't think so
picture and this horrific smell that we're witnessing right now. Just so remember that the, those guys, the militia and, uh, and uh, uh, tea partners, whatever they are out there, I mean, I'm a 912 guy, not a militia guy, that uh, we strapped on our guns to protect their cattle from going this way, from them going this way, and their way of life, because this is just pure evil. I can't see how any, any, any human being whatsoever can look at this and say this is acceptable. I mean, there's absolutely no justification whatsoever. It breaks my heart. I mean, it just it makes me weak. How did these cattle end up here? They uh, they they had they had their uh, subcontractor cowboys and they and they brought yeah, them in who? here. So, yeah. So then they, they shot say them. Who? Or, say that. I don't know the name of the company, but that uh, that brought them in. But it was the BLM. They 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 spent Warren. I think several million dollars on the, on a contract cowboy but BLM was here on site this is our main staging spot this is oh, if you right over your back to, to your right is the, where BLM's are oh, they had all their office trailers all their generators everything so everyone who was in BLM they were right here and what is that uh, uh, hundred not even 50 yards 50 yards from where they parked their trucks when they went to work in the morning they knew this was here and, and what they did is they executed these cattle the Bundy's Price heard and threw them in, in this hole and buried them hoping that, that they'll never see the light of day. And that's fresh blood, so that's it wasn't blood. long ago. It's running out of them. That leg's another one. I think that hit the, uh, if the cattle have been dead for a long time, the blood would have coagulated and, and there wouldn't be any, the, uh, the blood would run out of them. Blood's still running out of the bullet hole. Oh my god. That's a bullet hole. Right here. Yep, right there. That's our tax dollars That's at work, buddy. Entrance wound. That's exact. Yep. That's exactly how one, they killed one of the one of their large bulls. They had a bullet hole right between the eyes. And the other one was shot through the head, through the horns, and then about the body. I counted five shots and one up. America is so sanitized to the reality of what's going on in this country. That folks is blood. Think you're safe in this country? This is America, folks. I tell you what, this thing has been so horrific for me, I just had to walk away from this. Poor cows had their last supper, Trace. What's your feelings after seeing this, honey? It made me cry. Huh? It made me cry. It's terrible. It's just... It's, it's just... I have no words right now. It's a loss. 